Hi, I'm Tim, and welcome to our channel, and thanks for logging on. Today, we're discussing the Ball Train Master Worldwide. You can see and you can purchase this World Time Day Date Chronograph on our website. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if you enjoy these videos, and please click on the card in the upper right hand corner of the screen at any time during this video to see our full sales listing for this watch with additional accessories included in the sale, high resolution images for your desktop, and naturally complete pricing details concerning this and our entire collection of Ball Time pieces. Now, the watch on my wrist represents an immense store of complication in a single 43 millimeter space. To be more precise, it is a 43.5 millimeter round case across the round from 9 to 3, not inclusive of the crown or chronograph pushers. Now the watch isn't as thick as you might expect, 15.3 millimeters with a generously double-stepped bezel. It easily slides underneath a suit jacket cuff, possibly even the dress sleeve beneath. And you can see from lug to lug, 51 millimeters, it's not excessively girthy across the wrist, easily fitting on my 16 centimeter circumference wrist. I believe you could wear this watch down to a wrist size of 14 and a half centimeters as long as your wrist is more oval than round. Now it is a hefty piece, substantial though, it inspires confidence in the quality and the tolerances of the materials. A very solid multi-link bracelet, handsomely finished with contrasting polished and satin finished elements. You'll also note there's a little bit of a resemblance of railroad tracks down the center with railroad ties flanking. Of course, Ball is an old American railroad chronometer name. Today, manufactured in Switzerland, but they like to pay homage to their heritage. And of course, the imagery of the railroad is present in some of the details of the watch. You can even see that inboard of the case, which is handsomely polished with a few bevels and crease lines about the case and the step of the bezel. But inboard, you can see that the calibrations, the indices, the subdials, and the hands for hours and minutes are a little bit vintage evocative. The dial is also beautifully calibrated, colored, and easily readable in spite of the massive information available. Let's start with the basics, working our way in from the bezel. You can see that the world time reference ring, the 24 principal cities for 24 principal time zones, slopes down to a 24 hour world time ring that does is mobile. It is a true world time, so you can read next to each city the time and then read your minutes at center, the time in hours on the ring, the time in minutes at center, and then the time at the center dial, hours and minutes is where you are currently. A chronograph with registers for seconds at center, as well as minutes at 12 and hours at six, constant seconds at nine o'clock, a day date function at three o'clock with black letters for Monday through Friday, green, Railroad green for Saturday and railroad red for Sunday. There's a double quick set feature for the day and the date. Now you can see that the watch features a highly stylized counterweight to the seconds hand to go with those florid vintage evocative and tracer illuminated hour and minute hands. More on that in a moment. There's also a geosphere embossed pattern to the dial itself, which you can see on the matte black base from this angle, and then sunken sub-registers with polished chapter rings for the chronograph functions. You'll note that each of the applied indices actually features a small tube of tritium gas. These are known as tracers, and they're how tritium is done in the modern era, safely encapsulated. It is a beta emitter, beta particle, so radioactive, it's actually self-activating. So even if you were to put the watch for instance, into a dive locker, pull it out, two years later it would still be glowing. It does not need to first be exposed to light before it can glow. Now I mentioned that there are quite a few functions here. I should explain the world time chaptering one more time. Each of the cities on the outermost ring represents one of the 24 principal time zones of the world. Now you can see there's this white and black reference ring calibrated up to 24 with the sun and the moon. This is where you read the hour adjacent to each one of these individual cities before reading the minutes at center. That's how the world time system works. It's known as a Louis Coche world time system originally used by Vacheron Constantin and Patek Philippe during the 1930s, invented appropriately enough by Louis Coche. Now, the watch features a display case back, so you can see the Valjoux 7750 that powers the timepiece. It features a number of handsome machine applied enhancements, including perlage, tumble polished components, the perlage principally across the winding rotor, most of the levers of the chronograph mechanism. You can see the shuttle for the camera ray just below my finger being tumble polished with blued screws. It has a 42 to 44 hour power reserve. It does feature hacking seconds, so you pull the crown, you stop the balance and synchronize to a reference time. There is a quick set for both the day and the date functions. The watch, thanks to its screw down crown, is water resistant to 50 meters. 
And though a cam-operated chronograph, it's highly tuned to the point that you really do feel a crisp detent for the start, the stop, and the reset functions of the chronograph. It's also tank tough with an efficient unidirectional winding system. This is a handsome watch with a compelling value proposition. Automatic winding, chronograph, day, date, and a world time, all in a versatile 43.5 millimeter steel case with a substantial bracelet and clasp. And note the bracelet entirely adjusted and sized using screws, not pins, sleeves, or spring bars. A lot of watch for the money, objectively an attractive, handsome, and balanced product. One of the most readable complicated chronographs you'll encounter. This is the Ball Trainmaster Worldwide, available on our website.